Hi, hello and welcome back to our YouTube channel Excel Bus Software Testing where you will learn in easy simple way. So we are going to see today is Browser Stack, a tool for cross browser compatibility testing. So let's get started. This is your browser stack dashboard. Once you type browser stack on Google, you'll get the first link that you will redirect to. And this is your dashboard. Here it is pricing. Pricing is there for each and everything. Separate pricing they have mentioned. If live, live means you want to test if on it is on browsers, then you have to purchase for live. Then you want to test apps, then it is app live if you want to automate anything on different browsers even different with the help of different tools this is the pricing for automation so like this there are so many different prices you can purchase whatever is your project requirement there is a free trial for it you can try it for free for first 30 minutes and even 100 minutes for automation 100 minutes for mobile automation 5000 screenshots and currently for demo purpose i am showing you a free trial what you can do is if you want to learn you start a free trial subscribe there and once your free trial is over again log in to uh, with the same id and unsubscribe your account i'll do uh, i'll register as a free user and then i'll show you the dashboard by default it started with the mac os 15 and then it is asking me for a switch browser so if you go here you'll get so many options this is for ios if you want to test your websites on phone or ipad you can use all this option and then if you want to try it on android mobile there are so many innumerous options they have given then if you want to use windows then windows 11 10 8 you can test your application windows 8 then edge browser 109 or otherwise if you want to test on firefox windows 8 firefox triple one like these combinations you can make with whatever is your project requirement and with the help of that you can test here everything you will get under one umbrella you have mac there are so many mac versions are there in each mac mac os they have provided all the browsers with all the versions which are using currently over 3000 combinations you can make and you can test your application as per your requirements so let's start with the ios let's see if i go to iphone suppose i want to check one application on iphone 14 plus then they'll ask me if uh, whether you want to test it on safari or chrome if i click on chrome then they are simulating the environment of iphone 14 plus chrome version see you they have given you similar environment what iphone 14 chrome browser will have see for testing purpose i have uh, opened this amazon website with some random product let's see let's copy this url to your simulator and let's check whether it is see you can test here how it how it's look and feel in iphone 14 you can check amazon website here zoom you can zoom in zoom out see you rotate the device and then test whether you are able to test or not in free trial you will get one minute with each uh, device we will check with the uh, android let's see motorola similarly see same here you know need to paste url again they have taken their url itself and now you can see same user experience in uh, iphone 14 and even motorola as well you can rotate the device you can change the location let's see 
will change the location and you can perform geo location testing change the location and then you can check whether you are able to see it or not yes you can see it properly see this is one advantage of browser stack you can perform mobile application testing as well and mobile testing as well mobile testing means what install the application uninstall the application uh, check the application or test the behavior of the internet interruption or calling interruption and bluetooth interruption so many different things you can check with the application so these becomes your mobile testing and then mobile app testing is your application if you are testing that becomes your mobile application testing so if you want to check your application with other things like install the application then un, um, or uh, check with the interruption whether internet how your application is performing while internet is not available so like this you can perform different versions different browsers different os different mobiles everything because when you go to any company maybe it's not possible to perform purchase each and every device for that company and then you cannot test them but this browser stack is very good application you can test all the kinds of devices here and this one was live if you go to automate let's see what is there you can do automation testing selenium you have to choose then you can choose with java node.js python ruby so many options are available this this was app this was automation then if you go to app live then how to do it click on app live this is your app live dashboard they are opening with iphone 13 mini by default You can install app here, you can uninstall like I said. You can record the session. There are so many things you can do with this browser stack. Then you can new, uh, install new app or otherwise you can install your apps from your play store or app store. You can capture screenshot. if you find any bug if you find bug on this apple app store suppose then you click the screenshot then you can simply take the screenshot so you can test here with the sample apps if you have any apk or any jpa or other extension files then you can upload the file from here or you can download via play store or app store if you are selecting ios here you can download it from app store and you can good to go then you can perform mobile application testing from here and then you can change the network from here like 3g 2g and you can check the performance of your application so each and everything you can test here and the main advantage of browser stack is extensive documentation and support it offers you knowledge base faqs and community forums where user can find the answers to their questions and interact with the other users as well so best technical support and the disadvantage is like it will be it is higher at the pricing 
so if you it is little bit expensive tool so compared to other testing tools but it gives you wide range of variety of devices and browsers so it is worth it i guess so overall browser stack is an excellent choice for businesses and organizations that requires an extensive cross browser compatibility testings and can afford its pricing so it's it is easy to use and its support makes it popular device among the developers and testers but its lack of native mobile app testing may be downside for some users so this is it for today if you like this video please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel please share this video to your family and friends and your testing aspirants we post videos on every tuesday and friday so if you have any queries please write down to us in comment section and till then happy testing bye bye